Hey, this is Chris Martin with Relevant Media. This is a new blog for businesses that are looking to do do-it-yourself projects. And the first thing I want to talk about today is the new Select and Mask in Photoshop. So we'll just do these quick tutorials, last a few minutes, and then we'll be done. So they're kind of quick tips, actually. Now, if we select this guy right here, he's got a lot of flyaway hair. This is a very difficult uh, masking project, or it normally would be. But with the new algorithms that Photoshop has put into the Select and Mask tool, it's pretty fast. Let's go up here, pull the transparency down. Now, if you don't see this transparency slider, if you come over here and you select black and white and then go back to onion skin, this will come up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my quick selection tool and I'm going to make a selection of the boy. There we go. Let's go take a look at our black and white view. Let's go back to onion skin. And what we're going to do is we are going to turn on smart radius and pull the radius all the way up. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to grab my refine edge brush tool. And I'm going to make some selections here. Just paint over that. I come over here and do the same thing. Now let's take a look at our black and white view now and you can see it's it's picked up a lot of that. Let's go back to onion skin. Maybe paint over here a little bit more. Let's pull that transparency up. You can see it looks pretty good. Okay, we can make a couple other changes here. We may want to feather it. Um, a little tiny bit and if we click and if we click on decontaminate colors then we come up with something like this okay so that was our first quick tip tutorial for relevant media I'm Chris Martin we'll see you next time